two philosophies. One that's been in place a long time, and the other one, well, his team's just still getting used to it. Yeah, that's right, Jim. They're getting used to him. You said it there. So when they're getting used to it, you've got to play very conservative and careful. On the other side, the coach that's been around for a long time, he knows all the situations. He knows how he can trust his team. So to me, he's the guy that can take more gambles, and I'll tell you what, that could be the difference in the game. Offense lines up here. First and ten. LaShawn McCoy takes the handoff. When a coach can have a run, it picks up those kind of yards. It gives them confidence, and they will show more and more patience with the running game. So the defense, they better dig in here. Offense lines up here. Second and three. Trying to work that left side. Very nearly intercepted. I think this is one of the easier throws in the NFL. Don't make the mistake throwing it up the field. Throw it across the field so the receiver can run to it. That time, the quarterback leads the receiver way too far on the post run. So after that last incompletion, it is third and three. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Imposing their will early on the defense with a solid effort on the ground. Well, we talk so much, don't we, about the passing game in the NFL, but it's still about who can out-hit the other one, and right now, the offense, they are winning that battle. Nice run. First and ten. Fix looking long. What a catch down the middle of the field. How you perform inside the red zone is often the difference in a game, and we'll get an early taste of that. No doubt about it, Jim. you got to be creative when you get in the red zone. We'll see what the offense calls. First down, following the long play. McCoy's got it on the handoff. Gain of eight. That's a nice, powerful statement as they establish the run at the beginning of this game. Well, Jim, I, you're, you're right. I'm going to give the offense a little credit here, but, you know, somewhere, I don't know, maybe the defense might have to put some weights in their pockets. you got to hang in there and make the tackle. Gain of two. Jim, the defense gives up the first down that time inside the red zone, but there's only so many things the offense can do. Let's see if they can hold them. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Screen play is on. Touchdown! Good job that time by the offense, scoring that touchdown and putting them ahead. And when you get ahead in a football game, the National Football League, it makes you relax and you play better. Extra point is good. Eagles getting set for the kickoff. Signals, fair catch. And a touchback. First down, offense readying for the snap. Eyeing that left side. Ball is caught. Breaks free. Another name for the fly route, the go route. It's a streak. And that means they want you to be a blue streak, run as fast as you can, get by that defense, and make a big play. Black 58 rail. Black 58 rail. Austin's going to get set in the slot for this snap. First down and 10. And he's brought down right at the 42. Second down now. Looks to his left. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. That was an incomplete pass that time against cover two, the two deep safeties. And you really want to throw the football down the middle or deep down the sidelines. That time the quarterback didn't do that, and that's why it was incomplete. Third down here, offense trying to pick up the first. Looking across the middle, has the reception all alone. Tackles made. 
zone defense doesn't work in the NFL like it used to. Good job by the quarterback reading that zone and finding the open guy. This play set up by the long gainer. And he'll go to the left. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. Hey, hey. It's now second down. Throwing now to his left. Brings it in for the score in the end zone. There's no doubt about it. When you score like that to tie up the game, it shifts momentum. And it's all up now to the offense of the other team to get back out there and get the momentum back on their side. Ball comes out, picking up the fumble. And now he's on the move. Pure determination. What a run. Touchdown. Good job on that touchdown. That puts them ahead. Better to be ahead than behind. The point after try is in the books. Let's get the injury report from Danielle Bellini. Guys, I just spoke with an Eagles official. The staff wasn't saying much about the injury other than it's not severe enough to keep him out of this one. So expect to see him back on the field shortly, guys. He had nowhere to go, and they deck him at the 16-yard line. The Eagles go with two tight ends on this play. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. Second down coming up. Gonna take off with it. And here he goes. I remember seeing Michael Vick in the national championship game when he played for Virginia Tech against Florida State. And man, could he run. And look how many years later it is now. And this guy can still run and hurt a defense. Offense lines up here. Now first and 10. Four yards. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. Jackson's a receiver in the slot. This is a screenplay all the way. They tackle him for a loss. In these type of situations, when you're losing the game, it's third and long. Don't try to be a hero, because when you try to be a hero, it's going to lead to a turnover. Then you really will be in trouble. Michael Vick will be under center. The Eagles get a first down, and now they'll be on the other side of the 50 after this play. It's third down and over 10 yards. you got to give your offensive line a lot of credit. They give the quarterback extra time, and he makes the throw down the field to pick up the first down. Here's the first snap after the big play. Working that left side. Ball's going to be incomplete. A hit knocked the ball out. That was a big hit by the defender that time. The receiver drops the football. I'll tell you what, I guarantee the next time he goes over the middle, he'll be looking for that defender. Nickel formation for the defense here. McCoy. And it's James Laurinaitis in on the tackle. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Let's see what they do on this third down situation. Vix will keep it on the quarterback sneak. Anytime you're in these short yarded situations, to me, if you have a quarterback that's able to do this, it is a plus for your offense. Quarterback sneak gets the first down. 
Chip Kelly now makes a debut in the NFL as a head coach. Coming over from the University of Oregon, there are a lot of folks who wanted him uh, coming into this offseason. Yeah, he was a hot coach. No doubt about it, Jim. A lot of people wanted him to be the, the head coach for their franchise. Uh, Chip Kelly, let's see. He might be one year late to the NFL. His system was used by a few teams last year. Now everybody spent the offseason getting ready for the read and react by the quarterback. We'll see how it goes for Chip Kelly. The defense has really done a good job here in this drive. They got this offense in a third long situation. Let's see if they can convert it. Mounting a serious drive. Third down and 11. On his way. What an effort and a touchdown. Well, that score ties the game up. Now on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. The Eagles with an extra point try on the way. Inside of the uprights. The Rams are ready to return the kick. Fair catch signal made. They'll take it at the 20. Black is the A rail. Black is the A rail. Austin's lined up in the slot. Just a quick drop back. He'll fire it out to the left. That catch will extend the drive. When the defense is going to play safe and they don't want you to run by them, you've got to be able to throw these out routes where the receiver's cutting towards the sideline and the quarterback stick it in there. Sam Bradford will be under center. First and ten. The throw to the left. An incompletion right there, but it really should have been an interception. Second down coming up. He'll fire it out to the left. Met at the 40-yard line. Good job by the play caller that time. Calling for the short pass. Even though it comes up short of the first down, it opens up many things that you can do on third. You can run a reverse, draw plays, screen plays, or if you want, you can still throw it down the field. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them. The throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. Two minute warning. <laughs> that was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. That ball was in his hands. Well, he dropped the football, and there's no doubt why he dropped it. You have to look it in. Offense lines up here. Second and ten, looking for a receiver on the left side here. Good job by the quarterback that time. Makes the decision. Throws it short. It does not get the first down, but I promise you, Third and short is a lot easier than having third and long. Third down on the way. Handoff to the back. Slashes to the left side. The tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. Another first down by the offense. The defense is definitely getting fatigued. And when you get fatigued, you cannot think. So look out.
First down here after the run. Play fake here, trying to work that left side. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. Setting up in the pistol on this play. It's a second and four. Looking for an open receiver on the right. The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down, keep those chains moving, give yourself three more opportunities. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. First and ten. Looking to scramble. Number This long drive continues. Second and 11. Eyeing that left side. Reaches in, and that pass is incomplete. He did everything right, didn't he, the quarterback that time? He was physical. He stayed on the wide receiver. He was reading the quarterback. So it was easy for him to knock the throw down. Black 58 rail. Black 58 rail. The long drive continues. Here comes the wide receiver in motion. Third and 11. He's looking to the right here on this throw. The tackle is made short of the first, and that'll bring up fourth down. Should be what we call a gimme. No doubt about it. Put three on the board. Well, Jim, that field goal puts them in the lead. It was a nice drive by the offense. And what it does, it just gives you confidence. You did some positive things on the field, and it should carry over for you for the rest of the game. This is a big-time return. First down here. He's going deep. And they can't connect. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. And here we have second down. Scrambling out of the pocket. Long ball to Deshaun Jackson. He's in for the score. Boy, the defense is going to be upset after this long touchdown throw by the quarterback and receiver. They made a mistake out of position, and the offense took advantage of it, and they get the long throw for a touchdown out of it. He made it. Put the ball on the tee, and he's about to kick off. This kick will stay on the ground, avoiding a big return. Good piece of tackling. So that's going to do it for the first half. Eagles are up in this one. We're back here now in this one, where the Eagles lead by four. He'll have a chance to take off. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. Down. Sam Brad 
Bradford going down the field, and they can't connect. Outstanding coverage on the deep throw, forcing the incompletion. That's why he's one of the best in the league. He's aggressive. He can take away short passes, but also has the speed and the ability to get back there and knock down those deep ones, too. Failing to complete that one, so second down here. Makes the reception. When you're behind in a football game, all you can do on the offensive side is just go out there and thinking about making plays and picking up first downs, good job by the offense. Let's see how they back up the big play here. From the shotgun, Sam Bradford going down the field, and it's incomplete. Deep passes in the NFL, they always serve a purpose. You're not always going to get the completion, but at least it gets the defense thinking that you will try some long throws down the field. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. Looks to his left, lays out, and makes the play. Uh, there's nothing the defense can do. When you talk about a receiver like these guys out there now, and, and this one in particular, a double coverage, they're still able to go in between the defenders, rise up, and make the catch. After the long gain, let's see what they do here. It's handed to the running back. It's up six. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Second down here. Here we go now. A little screen set up here. Down. Nothing like having a quarterback who has a good arm who can who can just fire that football into some tight spots. And then it helps when the receiver has got the talent and the courage to go in there and make that tough catch. Rams ready to boot the football down the field. Vick will be under center. First and ten, the give to the running back. And there's only two yards to be found right there. In this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time, they stopped that run just for a short game. Jackson's lined up now as a slot receiver. Second and nine. Vick's looking long. Able to get a step on the defender, and he makes the catch. Touchdown, Philadelphia Eagles. What a terrible job by the defense. That time, nobody even covers the receiver. He is wide open down the field, and hey, nice job by the quarterback going through his progression. He finds the open guy and gets a touchdown pass. Eagles getting set for the kickoff. Signals right away, fair catch. Left, 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 left. First down coming up. Throwing now to his left. Reaches out and snatches it. You know, if you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down. Now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you've got that defense guessing. First down here after the completion. Three, 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 three. Back to the end, right? 
Looking to go up top again on first down. He makes the catch, and they bring him down at the 36-yard line. Nice job by the quarterback finding the open guy short. They get the completion. They still do not get the first down there. And now they'll try over again on second down. Working that left side. The Rams now move the chains. This is about to stop running up in the NFL. The quarter route so many times. Receivers just go across the field. They go short. But when you make these double moves like that, you get wide open. And what a throw by the quarterback. Hey, hey. Zing, zing, zing. Zing, zing, zing. That long game sets them up here on this play. Brought down at the 29. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go. And they stop him for a short game. Second down following the run. He'll fire it out to the left. Off the mark here as this throw heads out of bounds. It'll be third down. Sam Bradford going down the field as the catch, but the feet are not down. I don't think there was a miscommunication between the receiver and the quarterback. The quarterback just overthrew the pass. The Rams getting set to try the kick for three. It converts on the three. Well, this guy's a machine. Every time he gets a chance to go out there and kick a field goal, it is right down the middle. Good job by the offense. Good job by the kicker. And they're all over him at the 18-yard line. Jackson's in the slot. First and ten. He'll throw it over the middle. Catch is made. Breaks away. Tackled down at the 28-yard line. Good job by the offense picking up a first down there. They've been terrific all day long. They're winning the football game, and they are tiring this defense out. McCoy's lined up directly behind the quarterback here. Fix back at it now. Dropping back once again. Intercepted. In on the stop. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did. They got the interception. formation here for the defense they give it to the running back brought down by Trent Cole nice run that time by the running back and if they keep running the football like this it's just a matter of time before they fake it and throw that football over the top of the defense they are being physical the running back doing a good job and they are making it happen in the running game today this will probably be the last play of the quarter first and ten flip to the outside Stutter step move. 15 minutes to go. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Left, 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 left. After running it. It's second down. Bradford still got the football after the play fake, bringing the play to an end. Sometimes it's good protection by the offensive line, and sometimes it's just bad defense. They can't get to the quarterback, and that's another completion by him.
Third and four coming up following that completion. Looking to the right side and throwing. No one in sight has the grab. Good job by the offense, another first down. The defense absolutely is getting tired. And when you get tired, you make mistakes. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Here's the handoff and they'll run it. Nothing too exciting here, just plowing ahead, getting closer to that goal line. Well, they're trying to find out if this defense has the courage and toughness to stand up to them. So far, they haven't. This defense, they better pick it up if they think they're going to stop this offense. Second down. Gets it again here. Running right through the trenches. Good job by the offense getting in the red zone. Now you're down some points. You got to find a way to score a touchdown. Lines up here. Third and goal to go from the two. Toss to the outside. There's a signal from the far side. The hands are up. It is a touchdown. Well, the defense knew that they were probably going to see a run here in third and goal. And what do they do? They don't, it doesn't matter. They still get blown off the line of scrimmage by the offensive line. Nice job. This works out about 40% of the time if you look back on history, and they'll go for that two-point conversion. The quarterback motions the wide receiver. Put an additional two points on the board as they convert. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. Jackson's going to get set in the slot for this snap. First and 10. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Muscles through the defender. Gains five. Well, when you talk about throwing these sideline routes or the out route, it is about timing. When that receiver makes that break to go towards the sideline, that football has to be in the air. Nice throw and catch that time. That leads us to second down. The throw to the left. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field. And my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there. No doubt about it. That makes everybody nervous. On the way, third down. Long ball. To Deshaun Jackson, almost intercepted. These NFL receivers are so fast that you just got to get rid of that football and let it go. That time the quarterback waits a little too long and he underthrows the receiver down the field. The Rams defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Gets away from the pressure. That's a missed opportunity, and now they'll have to bring out the defense. Situations like this sometimes can cost you the game. You're down in the second half. 
why would you go for it on fourth down in this situation? You don't get it, that decision might cost you this football game. First down, just about seven and a half minutes to go in this one. So many things you can do on first down, and what do you come up? You come up with that play. That was just a bad play call. Austin's a receiver in the slot. Second down and 11. He has the grab. Well, I guess the only good thing you can say about that play, the quarterback, Taffy, he gets a completion, but it only goes for a couple yards. We're late in the fourth, and the offense is just trying to sit on the lead. Third down and eight. He'll fire it out to the left. The no stopping him. Taking it all the way home for the touchdown. You got to take advantage of situations like this. Not often in the NFL do you get somebody this wide open. Good job by the receiver. Nice job by the quarterback. Zaning. And what do you get? An easy touchdown pass. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. And he's met head on right there at the 20. Selleck's a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. When you spy the quarterback, what it does, it just makes it easier to throw the football and complete those passes. Less people cover the receivers down the field. Michael Vick will be under center. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. Escaping the pressure. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Just two minutes left in this one now. Back in a moment. Selleck's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. Trying to work that left side. Catches me. Well, I guess the best thing to say there, Jim, is they completed the pass, but it still did not get a first down. McCoy's lined up as the single back. It's third and nine, eyeing that left side. Almost intercepted that time. You might as well catch it because you're going to take the big hit no matter what. That time, the receiver lets the ball go because he was worried about the defender making the hit. Selleck's playing out of position in the backfield here. Looks to his left. Brings it into his body. Well, it doesn't look like much, but it really serves the purpose. Picks up the first down, and now they have a chance to open things up. Under two minutes to go in the half, and that means we've got a booth review. Well, it was called one way on the field, but now inside of two minutes, it was a booth review, and the call is overturned. I think if you left it up to the coaches, they'd like the, the booth to review them all, Jim, because put all the pressure on the officials in the NFL. That's what it's there for, to overturn bad calls on the field. That encroachment penalty gives the offense a free five yards. Yeah, when you play offense in the NFL, you take all the free yards you can get. That is a, that's a, just a good break for the offense right there. Still first down. Go, go, go. 
They'll take that gift from the defense and line up now with a new set of downs. Throws to the right. 